All right, guys, welcome to the channel. Who's Luca Rod? Sorry about the wind today. First time here, we do auto show uh, videos, detailing videos, uh, auto repair, all around car channels. Something like uh, something you like, man. Hit that subscribe and like and comment. Right here, I'm going to show you right now. It's been a month that Turtle Wax, the second coat, has been on the Ford Fusion. We're going to show how dirty it, uh, it is. And then what I'm going to do either today, I got some running around to do. I'm going to try to do it today or tomorrow. I'm going to take it to spray car wash, but I'm going to just spray it with the water with no soap, and I'm going to hand wash it. I don't want this coal on my driveway. That's what it is. Hopefully, you guys can see all the black specks. Now, this is dirt right here. Now, this is a filthy vehicle. I mean, look at the windshield. If you can tell, hopefully, this, it comes out. See the difference here. Check it out. There. And that's how trash this vehicle gets. Look at that right there. You can check it out. Look at the black specks right there. It's like a fallout from all the industrial companies in the area. You can see how dirty that's it. Look at that. It's black. It's black dirt. I know we're not supposed to do this, but if it scratches, I'm just showing it. See how filthy it gets. I'll polish it this spring. Look at that. Look at that. It's nasty. The mirrors, it's everywhere. Now this is a uh, filthy vehicle. Great to test products on by where I work. Good old specs right there. We'll wash it up. So basically, this is gonna be the one month update. A little bit longer. But a second coat, one month update, turtle wax ceramic spray. And then uh, I'm gonna wash it. I'm not using no boosters to uh, to uh, prolong, to make the product you know last longer. Cause they, turtle wax does have on their ceramic line they have more products you know they have the soap that helps boost it stuff like that we're just going to use a regular soap with no uh gloss in it no wax in it Let's see how long it works last for for uh, this test real real test all right just look at it real fast tell me how what you guys think with that she dirty tomorrow's the weather's supposed to be around the same so I might be washing it tomorrow right after work. I'm gonna try to do it today, but I have an appointment to go to. If it's still daylight, then I'll do it. But I don't want this stuff on my driveway. So I'm gonna spray it down with the regular water. I take the chlorine core wash and then we'll hand wash it here. But I won't use their soap. We'll just use the water. So we know we're not getting a soap in case they're not their soap's not pH balanced. Check that out. There we go. Got a nice splash. All right. Keep on watching. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. All right, guys. What do you guys think? How filthy it gets. All right. See you when I wash it. how filthy we'll see if it gets any water beads on it being this dirty just water ah no pressure it ain't got no damn pressure it is dirty dang that's even great you guys see how dirty it is look at that Still got a hand wash at home. I want to get all this junk off my car. Now this is how you test a product out. Real test. Uh -huh. What do you guys think?
all right, I'm gonna head home and we'll hand wash it. Get it ready to hand wash. It's 40 degrees right now. But you can see just from it dirty, it's, it's man, it's sheeting great. Beating nice with all that dirt on it. Man, that's pretty good. So uh, we'll hand wash it and we'll check it out. All right, guys, we're going to wash it up. I'm not going to show the whole process of washing up. Now with the, we already sprayed out the car, coin car wash, but check out the, the sheeting and beads right now. Before I wash it, see how dirty it still is. With the black dots, see it? Right here. We'll get to wash it with the soap and then we'll uh, check it out. We're pretty much already know it's gonna sheet good. We'll see what kind of the shine looks like and stuff like that still. Cause it's it's beating the sheeting great without even washing it. So where do you know it's still gonna do it? Hope you can see those black dots. They're coming out pretty good, a little bit of pressure. And the black dots from the fallouts coming right off. See there's one there. It's gone. That's good. That uh that fallout contaminants, whatever dirt is not sticking. A little bit of effort, it comes right off. And plus, of course, the soap's gonna help also. Just gotta do a little bit of effort to get it off, but it's coming off. Another thing too, I'm not using a foam cannon. It's only 40 out. I do have one that a cannon that hooks up to the holes could use that maybe next time I'll use it but this I'm washing my car just from you know traditional way it proves that you really you really don't need to do it you can do it just like this and get your car clean and you're not gonna get it all scratched up use that uh, coin car wash to get the the heavy dirt off if you don't want that stuff on your driveway off whatever we've been lucky it's been snowing they saw it the road once, and then it basically melts. But check it out, look how clean that is. No foam cannon. Granted, it's nice using the foam cannon, it is fun. But a lot of times, you know, you gotta get all that stuff out. You don't have hours to wash your car. See that, get the dirt out. There, what do you guys think about that? You use the foam cannon every time you wash your vehicle, like you see on the other videos. Um, or you do it just like this and get it nice, get it nice and clean without scratching it. Foam cannons do work pretty good with the foam. You know, and it's fun messing with it and getting it all foam, and it probably does loosen up some of the dirt. It's warmer out. I'm gonna when this vehicle is really dirty, we'll foam cannon it with some different soaps. Heck, we could test a bunch of them out and see how well it breaks up the dirt on this. Yeah, you know, gotta get that fallout on it, but it comes out pretty good. What do you guys think about that? Okay, we're all done washing it. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna dry it off with no drying aid. So, try to get a true test without a booster on it. We'll dry it and on the hood we'll do a water test. And we'll see, and we'll do a little walk around. We'll see what the shine looks like. Also, the temperature's starting to drop now. It's probably maybe about 38 degrees here in Michigan. We've been having a mild winter. It's supposed to get down to 20s tomorrow. That's why I figured I'd do this video today. And then um, I'm gonna have to dry it a couple times because it's not warm out to uh, to get it. And it's, it's supposed to weird, it's supposed to warm back up to 50 Friday. And then maybe like, I think rain and light snow. I'll take this mild winter, that's for sure. 
All right, we'll dry it up and then we'll do that water test. All right, we're done drying it off. Let's take a quick look at it, then we'll do that water test. Still got a nice gloss to it. Look at that. Still looking good. Check that out. Yeah, looking good. Let's get that. Let's do the water test. All right, here we go. Cheating pretty good. A little bit slow on the sheeting. It's cool out too. This water's cold. There you go. Yeah, it's sheeting slow, but it's cool out too. You do so. There's sheeting pretty good there. Of course it will. Let's go center. It's not bad. She didn't decent. All right. What do you guys think? Let me know. How's it holding up? Sliding off. Right now, from looks of it, it's sheeting more than beating. All right. Let's try it on the side here. garden hose is kind of frozen so it's hard to move around all right ready alright there you go so it looks like right there Not bad. Vehicle's on an angle. You can see it's where it's more going towards the driveway. All right, guys, what do you guys think of it? Of the turtle wax, ceramic spray. I think it's holding up pretty good. Still, it was beating nice when uh had all the dirt. Now that it's uh, cleaned up, um, sheeting pretty good. Beating a little bit. More on the doors. Could be the way to... My vehicle sitting down, pointed down. Yeah, it's possible. The way it's it's slanted, but I think it's, it's holding up pretty good. The gloss is still there. It's uh, the dirt's coming off pretty easy when you wash it. You can see in the beginning of the footage how dirty it was, stuff like that. For using a drying aid, I think that would uh, help out a lot more, keeping it clean and stuff like that. The paint still feels nice and smooth still so that's good looking good all right guys tell me what you guys think um of the product how's it look how's it holding up you guys use it how do you guys like this product are you planning on getting it don't forget to like and comment and subscribe appreciate you guys watching this video i'll have some videos at the end links for you guys to check out all right guys you guys have a great one later